And now, presented by the BFA Mercury, it is the Playbook Update. Hello, everybody. We had technical difficulties last week, but we are ready to go, and we got a lot to talk about. We're going to start with some off-season stuff, and we are going to start with hockey as Ilya Kovalchuk, the Russian himself, is coming back, and he is looking at the Kings, Sharks, Rangers, and your Boston Bruins. So there is a chance... That we could have this man, the man who can turn back time, on Boston. And with that, we're going to switch over to some football. And, of course, you may know this by now, Julian Edelman is out with a four-game suspension for an illegal substance. We're going to see how the Patriots can do without him. They did go 3-1 and one without Tom Brady, so let's be honest, we'll do 2-2 two and two at the worst. Next up, though, we have basketball. And congratulations to the 2018 NBA champions, the Golden State Warriors, sweeping the Cleveland Cavaliers. And now we figure out what is going to happen with LeBron James. And I'm going to leave this up to you guys to talk about with everybody you know. Is he going to stay in Cleveland or is he going to Boston, Philadelphia, or Houston? I'm thinking more of Philadelphia because you've got Joel Embiid in the front court with Ben Simmons in the backcourt, I think the only thing that's stopping LeBron is a decent point guard. And Kyrie Irving was really the only person that could fill the void. And it really showed because that's the only championship he could win in Cleveland with a decent point guard. Of course, Boston is an option too. You've got Kyrie Irving. However, I'm not really sure how good-blooded they are between each other. We're going to have to see what happens there. It would be very good for Boston sports. Uh, Houston would be another great place for him to go he would have James Harden in the backcourt of course with Chris Paul who is still pretty good and having LeBron James as somebody who can drive to the rim that's a huge addition to the team they tried to beat the Warriors by shooting them out it didn't particularly work out so we're going to see what happens there next up we're going to talk about some baseball and in baseball we have Bartolo Colon, Big Sexy himself, getting 2,500 strikeouts for the Rangers. The Washington Nationals have Bryce Harper getting hit by a pitch twice in a game. He is okay. And Max Scherzer is balling out. He had his second immaculate inning. That is only the fifth time in history that a pitcher has done that. Next up for the Detroit Tigers, we have a huge hit from them. Miguel Cabrera is out with a ruptured bicep tendon. And this is going to be a huge absence as he is one of their best players. And while we check in with your Boston Red Sox, they're currently in a 10-game road trip, finished up with Baltimore in Seattle, and will head to Minnesota. They are fighting for first place in the division. So with all that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. This has been... The Playbook Update, now back to Alec Wolf and the Mixdown.